That's how I left teaching. That was so your first gig? First, first, first. And that gig, that show was going to go to Israel and Greece. We didn't perform here. We started rehearsing in Jobek. And then from there, Kiruna Bali, uh, Israel and Greece. And it was so exciting, even though there was a lot of opposition or, hey, man, don't go there. Sola, you know, sola. That's, that yes, was the name of that's the show. Sola, yeah, sola, yeah, yes. Yeah. Don't go there. This profession, you know, when you come back there, what are you going to do? I, I was not hearing them, Subu. Because at that time, more teaching, I was earning 101 rent per month. <laughs> ne? And here's an opportunity where I'm going to earn 100 rand a week. And after, and moreover, near Hamba, near overseas, you know? <laughs> oh, it was an international So for job. me, yes, yes, it was. Yes. So for me, it was a big thing. Or near Hamba, near Israel, and I said, Chris, and you call 100 rand a week. So that's how my career in entertainment started. Wow, it's so incredible, man, to hear you sh share your story. Ma, I always say to young entrepreneurs out there, even for people who are still in corporate, that guys, it's okay to be in corporate because what you're learning from their professionalism yes. 